subscribe to our channel. And if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up for more. Red Cat Reading. Learn to read. Sleep. Too tired. You've had a busy day with school, soccer practice, chores, and homework. Now you're ready to relax with a video, but your body won't cooperate. Just 10 minutes after you start watching, you're nodding off. You need sleep, and your body won't take no for an answer. Can't live without it. Over your lifetime, you'll spend about one-third of your life sleeping. Some people think that sleep is a waste of time. But try going without enough of it for a few days. It'll soon become clear that your body and mind need sleep to work right. You probably know when you haven't had enough sleep. You may have had a hard time thinking clearly. You may be cranky and may pick a fight for no reason. You may not have much energy. Following directions and playing sports seem much harder than usual. There's a great fix for all these problems. Sleep. Getting enough sleep isn't just about feeling better or thinking more clearly. It's also important for your health. Getting a good night's sleep helps your body grow. It also helps you fight off germs so you don't get sick as often. Some scientists also think the body uses sleep to heal itself. What happens when you sleep? Sleep is a time for your body and brain to rest. Most of your body's activities slow down. Your heart beats more slowly, and your body gets a bit cooler. Your breathing becomes slower and deeper. You don't notice sounds as much as you do while you're awake. Every night, your body goes through five different stages of sleep. Stage one, your eyes close and your muscles start to relax. It's easy to wake up if someone calls your name or taps you on the shoulder. Stage two, this stage of light sleep is a little deeper. You can still hear sounds and feel if someone touches you. Stage three, your sleep is getting even deeper at this stage. Your body doesn't respond as easily to sounds or touch. It's harder to wake up from this stage than stages one and two. Stage four, you're deeply asleep during this stage. If someone wakes you up, you're likely to feel confused or groggy for a few minutes. REM sleep, or rapid eye movement sleep. During this stage, your body is more active. Your heart beats faster, and your breathing is faster and less deep. Your eyes move back and forth very quickly under your eyelids. Your body isn't relaxed because this is the sleep stage when you dream. Dreams. You just arrived at school. You walk in the door, and go to your classroom. Sitting at your desk is a green kangaroo with a rainbow on its head. A giant hamster tells you to open your book and turn to page 20. When do you outfly a hundred butterflies? What's going on? You must be dreaming. No one knows for sure why we dream or what dreams mean. Scientists have many different ideas. Dreams may help the brain make sense of everything that happened during the day. They may help the brain sort through feelings and memories. Dreams may also show what we're thinking about or troubled about. Everyone dreams, but not all people remember their dreams. If you wake up during REM sleep, you're less likely to forget your dreams. With practice, you can get better at remembering your dreams. Adults and children both have bad dreams or nightmares once in a while. Nightmares can be scary and upsetting, but they can't hurt you. Nightmares are usually about troubling things that happen during the day. 
They may be related to worries at school or at home. Scary books and movies can also cause nightmares. So can a high fever. Sleep problems. Many people fall asleep quickly and get a good night's sleep, but others have trouble falling asleep or staying asleep. These people have a condition called insomnia. Insomnia may go away on its own. If not, a doctor might be able to help. Snoring is another common sleep problem. When people snore, body parts in the throat move back and forth very fast and make sound. In some people, the sound is soft. In most people, however, it is loud and bothersome. Snoring is caused by partly blocked air. There are many ways to help people who snore. Some people have a breathing problem called sleep apnea. This condition causes breathing to stop for very short periods of time during sleep. Some children have sleep apnea because their tonsils or adenoids are large. Having them removed can often fix the problem. In adults, losing weight often helps bring an end to sleep apnea. Many children walk in their sleep. They don't remember sleepwalking when they wake up. Most children stop sleepwalking by the time they become teens. Sleep talking is another common condition. People who talk in their sleep may mumble or speak in full sentences. Most sleep talkers have no memory of it later. Getting enough sleep. You've probably heard people say, be sure to get enough sleep. How much is enough? That depends on your age. The younger you are, the more sleep you need. The number of recommended hours drops throughout a person's life. Are you between the ages of 6 and 13? If so, you probably need between 9 and 11 hours of sleep each night. Getting enough sleep helps your body feel better. It helps you pay better attention so school, sports, and other activities are easier. Getting enough sleep also helps you be in a better mood. It even helps you find the right words when you speak. People who study sleep have come up with many ideas that can help with sleeping well. Sleeping animals. Humans aren't the only animals that need sleep. Almost every kind of animal sleeps. Some sleep for just a few hours each day. Others sleep almost all the time. Animals sleep underground, underwater, on the ground, and in trees and caves. They sleep while lying down, standing up, hanging upside down, and even flying. How do you like to sleep? The end. Subscribe to our channel. And if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up for more. For more stories and worksheets, check our website.